Extremadura, Spain is known for its different ways of preparing the Iberian pork and mutton. The main characteristics of the traditional Extremaduran cuisine were its simplicity, its lack of clutter and its low cost. It is also a cuisine reflecting a generous spirit, for many of its preparations used to be cooked in large pots to share with visitors, friends and neighbors. The resulting dishes are eaten with local bread. The preferred spices in Extremaduran cuisine are pennyroyal, garlic, bay leaves and anise. Olive oil is used for frying and as an ingredient in many dishes. Representative dishes Among the pork or mutton-based dishes, some of the most well-known are the calos con manos de cerdo tripe with pig's feet, caldereta de cordero mutton stew, cabrito en cuchifrito, frita de cordero mutton fry, and the cabrito a la hortelana kid and vegetable stew. The chanfina in Extremadura has nothing to do with similarly named dishes in the Iberian Peninsula, like the Catalan zanfina, which is a Spanish version of the Occitan ratatouille. The Extremaduran chanfina is a rich stew of mutton liver, brain, heart and kidneys cooked with a mixture of bay leaves, garlic, bread crumbs and boiled eggs. Traditional Extremaduran gastronomy includes other meats, like hen galina, which is one of the main ingredients of the emblematic casito extremeño stew, hera rose con liber rice with hair, and frogs ancas de ranas fritas fried frog legs. It also includes local fishes like the tench tenkas fritas fried tenches and trout truches con jamon trout with ham, and even a certain large lizard usually prepared in guisado, made by frying slices of lizard in olive oil, after which they were stewed over a slow fire. Currently lizards are a protected species and trapping them is prohibited. Among the basic popular dishes the ones based on chickpeas are dominant. Other main ingredients are habichuelas beans, potatoes, pumpkin, chestnuts, onions and bell peppers. The most famous dishes of Extremadura are the casito extremeño, the pataje de garbanzos y judías blancas chickpea and bean soup, the sopa blanca de ajos white garlic soup, the pataje de castañas secas chestnut soup, the a la con asora". A stew with offal and blood, the ajablanco extremeño and the gazpacho extremeño a variant of gazpacho with ham. There is very little in the way of vegetarian dishes in the traditional cuisine. Some of the ancestral dishes of Extremadura are fast disappearing, like the migas and the gachas. These are very ancient dishes, one of the most prominent being the migas con torresnos. Vegetables like cardoon and borage were formerly widely used in soups. Certain dishes of the Extremaduran cuisine show the influence of neighboring Portugal, like the lentijas estofadas stewed lentils and the sopa de perdices partridge soup. Topic: <inaudible> Embutidos. <inaudible> Extremadura's Iberian pigs are usually left to roam in relative freedom and their main diet are the acorns falling from the local oak trees. Their meat is highly valued throughout Spain, especially their ham. Extremaduran embutidos pork preserves have a local flavor, like the morcia based on blood and onion, morcias de cabeza head innards morcias, morcias patateras potato morcias, as well as morcias prepared with pumpkin. Dry cured pork products include chasinas and the local ham, longaniza and chorizo. Desserts and sweets Extremaduran desserts and sweets are mostly prepared using the local wheat flour, honey, pork fat, milk, sugar and olive oil. The most well-known are the buñuelos, magdalenas anise -parfumed muffins, perunilas, galetas, rosquias de vino, roscas fritas fried donuts, coquillos de miel, iuelas, gachas extremeñas, bollos fritos fried buns, floretas, socochones herdanas and the geringas. <laughs> 